Here's a fact for you. 200,000 years of human history, the last 12 only were lived online. So if you were to just do the numbers on that, it's something like, and I'm going to ask some of these accountants, I'm sure they're pretty good with numbers. It's something like 0.01, so 0.01% of our existence has been online and 99 point remainder has been offline. Meaning that all of our meaning is found in the offline space. You know, the human brain is geared towards offline analog interaction and 12 years of online ain't going to rewire that. That's millions, I don't know, billions of years of evolution in that organism there. And as much as we talk about millennials this and millennials that, the reality is, is nothing can replace offline contact. And that's very much true in technology as it is in branding as it is in just human interactions in general. You know, there's a hormone in the brain. I believe it's called something like oxytocin. And uh, I'm sure some bio people can pull me up on this. So basically, let me just rewind a little bit. Oxytocin is this hormone generated by the brain. And it is generated um, in response to contact and I think it, it's something to do, like, you know, when babies are born, the brain, I'm sure I might have got the wrong hormone or the wrong chemical, generates this oxytocin to reward the behavior of contact. So when you have contact between mother and baby, it creates this hormone. My point being is that it's hardwired in the brain for physical contact. And, that, you know, you can't replace that with, an, a, a, you know, a, a WhatsApp message. You can't replace that with an online platform, that connection is in the chemistry, in the nuts and bolts of human.